Hi everyone. So today I decided I'm going to do the TMI tag questions thing. So the first question is, what are you wearing? So I am wearing a um, peplum top, t-shirt top. I don't know if you're going to be able to see it. Yep, 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 yeah, you can see it. This I got from Forever 21 a while ago. Um, probably on sale or whatever. I love these peplum tops. It's funny because none of the people that I know like, like them. But I like them. I don't know, I think they're cute. So this is from Forever 21. My shorts are from American Eagle. And then my earrings are from Claire's. And that's it. That's all I'm wearing. That was easy. <laughs> First question's always the easiest, isn't it? Huh? Ever been in love? Yes, I have. I have. I have. That's the way they're asking. They don't want any details, I guess. Uh, ever had a terrible breakup? I did. Mm -hmm. I think if you've ever been in love, you've had a terrible breakup. I think they go hand in hand. Like, cause I've been in love a few times. And obviously, some of them didn't work out. So, terrible breakup. Uh, how tall are you? I'm 5'3". Yes, 5'3". <clears throat> how much do you weigh? I weigh probably, what, 140 now. I was 130, and I gained some weight, so... <clears throat> do I have any tattoos? I have three tattoos. I have one on my wrist. I have a tattoo on my foot, and then I have a tattoo on my side, too. So the tattoo on my wrist is the delta sign, which means change if you're into science. And the opening is to remind me to be open to change, because sometimes I'm not very good with that. The tattoo on my foot is the, an angelic symbol that means embrace life. And then I have an angel on my side for my guardian angel, my nana. Any piercings, I have the first and the second hole of my ears pierced. I used to have my cartilage pierced, but I let it grow or close up. I got it done in Paris my junior year of high school, and it just, I don't know, I don't think it got infected, but I think whatever metal was in there irritated my skin, so any time after that I would lean on it, it would hurt, so I took it out. My mom and dad were not happy about that, by the way. Uh, my favorite show? Ooh. I guess it all depends on what's going on. I don't have an all- well, oh, that's a lie. I have an all-time favorite show. It's Friends, for sure. But right now, I just finished Orange is the New Black. That was amazing. Oh my god. Blew my mind. And now I have to wait a whole, what, year for the next season, which is depressing. So that's one thing right now. <clears throat> favorite bands? I don't have a favorite band because there's just too many that I really, really like. So it all depends on the genre. It all depends on everything, my mood. But um, I don't have an all-time favorite band. There's just too many. Even if I were to go with, like the classics or like you know what I grew up with, there would still be a lot. Well, this is an interesting one. Something that you miss. I definitely miss like childhood like I had a lot of block parties in my childhood I spent a lot of times outdoors things do get harder once you get older so I definitely miss like just the random happenings especially in the summer of my childhood all the parties we would have the friends that I had close by that was nice so definitely that my zodiac sign is a uh, Virgo I'm August 29th, so I was very close to being a Leo. My mother is a Leo, and she's August 13th, so I am a Virgo. <clears throat> Quality you look for in a partner, that's easy. I need somebody that's going to be goofy with me and who can tolerate my goofiness. I don't want a super serious relationship. I don't want to... I also don't want, like, a super not serious relationship, but I want to be able to have somebody who's, like, my best friend. So that's definitely there. Oh, this is a good one. Loud music or soft? <laughs> Both. Because when I'm going to work, for instance, I need loud music to wake me up. I need to get hyped up or when I'm going somewhere. But when I leave somewhere or when I leave work, I want soft music to calm me down. So, both, for sure. It all depends on where do you go when you're sad? My bed. I go straight to bed. I lay down. I might put on some TV, I might just chill, but that's what I do. 
I lay down in bed. The last thing that made you cry, I watched the season finale of Orange is the New Black and I cried. That was the last time I cried. That was last night. Hmm? I admit it, I cry at movies and shows and all that, even commercials, like that puppy commercial where they want you to save those abused puppy puppies. If I had the money, I would save them all, <laughs> especially because they make me cry like a baby. All right, the last person I talked to was Jason, my boyfriend, and the next question is the relationship between you and the person you last texted. We are boyfriend girlfriend. I love him. He loves me, and that's the relationship. Favorite food is basically everything. But if I had to choose one thing, probably french fries. I love french fries. Place you want to visit? I definitely want to go to Ireland at one point in my life. Um, I definitely want to go to Spain as well. Basically anywhere in Europe I would go. Last place I was, what does that mean? Like, I guess traveling? The last place I traveled was Key West. And it was amazing. You saw the vlogs, you saw them. We had a blast. There's more to come to. I have one more to post. That's TMI. Do I have a crush? Uh, yeah, I guess technically. I mean, my boyfriend. I still crush on him. Like, when he texts me, I get all giddy and all that good stuff. So, yeah, him. <clears throat> Last time you kissed someone. Last night. We, um, yesterday we went kayaking down, um, a river in Mays Landing, Hamilton area, and yes, I kissed him last night when I left. Last time I was insulted, <laughs> probably yesterday. All right, so me and Jason were fishing, and I accidentally got it caught, like my fishing line caught in something, and he had just, I think he was saying as I got something caught is to put my rod somewhere else so that it wouldn't get caught in the tree, and it did, and he yelled at me because he was frustrated. And I'm obviously relationships, you fight, whatever it happens. But I was insulted because obviously I didn't mean to do that. But he was a jerk about it. So, boys, gotta love it. So that's probably the last time. Yep. Favorite flavor of sweet? Oh, that's a good question. My favorite favorite sweet of sweet is definitely chocolate. I love chocolate. Anything chocolate, I'm there, for sure. What instruments do you play? I used to play the guitar. Um, but I don't play it anymore. So that was the only instru instrument that I've ever played is the guitar. Favorite piece of jewelry? Definitely earrings. I wear earrings all the time. If anything else, I wear earrings. I don't wear bracelets often. I do have like Alex and Ani bracelets that I love, but I don't wear them often. Um, necklaces I wear more often than bracelets and less often than earrings. So definitely earrings. The last song you sang, I actually sang in the shower today. Uh, Girl Crush, I love that song. By uh, Little Big Town, I think it is. Yeah, that's a good song. I love that song. <clears throat> of course, nobody was home. That's why I sang it. I do not sing in front of people unless the music is blasting. The last sport I played, well, technically, um, kayaking and fishing are sports, so I did that. But the last sport I actually played as like an organized sport was softball. What's a chat-up line? It says favorite chat-up line. I'm going to Google it. Hold on. Let's see what a chat-up line is so that I can maybe answer that question. Chat-up line. Oh. Favorite pickup line. I don't think I've ever really used a pickup line. Well, I guess uh, there's funny ones. Like, um, I really like the movie Hall Pass, and I love all the pickup lines in that. Like... The one, does it smell like chloroform? That was pretty funny. Or, um, how much does a polar bear weigh? Enough to break the ice. That one's pretty funny, too. I've never used any of them, though. I've never used a pickup line. Ever. I've heard some. But I've never used one. Actually, I'll tell you a funny story. One I, I actually heard was, um, I was working at a bar. And this guy came up to me and he touched, like, my shoulder or my arm. And he goes, I just want to see what it was like to get to third base or something. I told him, listen, honey, if you want to pick up a girl, don't ever say that again. And who should answer these questions next? Megan. Definitely Megan. She should answer these. That was actually it. I thought, I didn't really skip that many questions either. Yeah, so that's it. That completes this TMI question tag video. 
So if you like these videos, if you want me and Meg to do like a best friend video, comment, thumbs up, subscribe, you know the drill. I will see you in our next video and have a good day.